Hello everybody, welcome to the United Way, Mason Gray Road to Italy, not what we expected this soon, we we're expecting an Onana, Andres Onana uh, the deal, yeah we go for Andres Onana, which <laughs> is taking a lot of time, I mean, but I know this weekend sometime on Monday, as I said on my video today in the afternoon that Onana will be a Manchester United player, but yeah, I mean some couple of hours ago, I mean we did some, we did some searching, yeah, and uh, I spoke to a contact of mine also who also saw this tweet from this uh, guy uh, in Italy who seems to have a connection with Atlanta and he has written there that Mason Greenwood, Manchester United and uh, Mason Greenwood, Mason Greenwood accepted an option to play for Atlanta uh, in exchange to Rasmus Holland, the Danish attacker, which I think is a good deal for Mason Greenwood. Uh, this is a uh, this this and uh, this deal, if it is true, right? If it is true, because yeah, if you're just jumping in, we're saying Mason Greenwood will be playing for Atlanta, not Juventus. We know Juventus were interested in Mason Greenwood. We know Fenerbahce was interested in Mason Greenwood as well. But Greenwood has chosen, apparently, Greenwood has chosen Atlanta. Um, to start his career. I think that is a smart man move. This gives me more hopes on the guy personally in the sense that he's giving the right advice. He doesn't need to go to an, an ambitious team. He needs to go to a team that he's the main man. He needs to go to a team that he's giving, you know, the free kicks, the penalties, the, the confidence. He needs to go to a team that will build his confidence and Mason Guru might come back uh, um, being a different person, a different player from next season. Uh, Italian league generally is a very physical league. It's a league in which if you play there, you don't gain only uh, your. If you're technically very good playing for Italian league, you will be f the physicality of Italian league. It might not be a, a very quick league like the Premier League, but the physicality you gain a lot. If you want to, if you're doubting me, Axel Zidane. He was a lazy player when he left Bordeaux and went to Juventus, and they made him a, a robot basically. So, with Messi, you is Messi Greenwood uh, uh, happy with this? I obviously I think yes. Has he made the right choice? Only time will tell. But I want to ask your, you guys the question. I know we do have a <laughs> Chief Odion here who will not be very happy. One of our, our, our subscribers on the channel, he will not be happy. And even most of you, because when I have done a lot of video about Mason Greenwood, uh, most of you want him to stay. But I've said I would love him to stay. But of late, I started understanding that it is better for Greenwood and also Manchester United that Greenwood leaves Manchester United. That is a big, 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 big story here that Mason Greenwood Road, will be playing for um, Atalanta. So Manchester United wants to buy. Why do we think this story could be credible? We say could be because it's something that has just burst into uh, the media now. Why do we say it? It's, it's already like four hours, four or five hours in the media. When I did my first video, it was out there, but I didn't want to rush on it. I don't like to rush because our channel, we, we talk about events we don't claim to be to breaking news this is not breaking news it could be breaking news for you but for the past five five uh, hours we have had information that Mason Greenwood will be playing for at uh, Atlanta he has accepted the deal to go to Atlanta Manchester United have always respected and admire Mason Greenwood's uh, talent I just want to tell all of you uh, Manchester United fans who might be disappointed that if United, Mason Green's salary is 70, reported to be 75,000 uh, 75, pounds a week. With what he did, if he was just an average player, a player which is not respected in terms of talent in Manchester United, they would have found a way to close him up and kick him out of the team. But he is such an asset. Football is a business. United need to find a way to manage the situation, and not only for Greenwood, but also the football club. We still have people who are doubting why United, for them, they want Messi Green to stay. The, one of the biggest reason that Messi Green cannot stay in Manchester United. Firstly, let's go to the, the player in concern. Imagine a young player playing in a team in a country where it is 50-50. Some want him to go, some doesn't want him to go. When things aren't going well, he misses a penalty, he doesn't score a goal, he will be whistled, it plays on his head, right? So mentally, it is not helpful for Mason Greenwood to stay in, in the Premier League. It is, uh, as I said, time heals, heals a lot. With time, you heal a lot. Time heals a lot of problems. So it, is, it was important that Mason Greenwood find a team that gives him an opportunity to express himself and then from there he will be uh, he will be more uh, helpful uh, to not only to his talent but to, the, to Manchester United in future so this is the situation you're missing Greenwood missing Greenwood uh, 
as we know, he's a very gifted player. Uh, and I think he's going to do well in the Italian league, which is not very quick league, but if Mason Guerrero can play 80% of his potential, he will do well for, for <clears throat> Atlanta and then be brought back to, uh, to the Premier League. And maybe United will give him a second chance. Maybe he will be sold. For me, I think that's a great, great uh, deal for him. Going to a club where he will not have too much uh, pressure. Uh, but yeah, too much pressure. I have a lot of, enough time to, to express himself. So this is my point of view. But you know what we do here on this community and this channel is to also communicate with you guys. What do you think about this Mason Greenwood breaking, breaking news? Do you think it's a good idea for Mason Greenwood? Drop your comments below. I would love to hear you guys what you think. Mason Greenwood, it seems to be, he is a, some call him a generational talent. He's very, one of the very few players United that has a, a stardom quality in him. Yes, he did the mistake which he did, but he wasn't found. He was found. He wasn't found. Um, <clears throat> uh, he wasn't guilty of anything, you know. He, he, uh, the, the, the crown prince let him go. So I, I don't see who am I to, to jump on Grayson Guerrero's character. And uh, pr reportedly, he's going to have child with the girl that uh, of concern. So yeah, this is the situation here with Manchester United. So this has made increase the fact what I was saying in my video today morning that. Uh, Ramos Holland, the Danish attacker, it's a year we go. Just it's just a matter of time for us to be listening. Year we go. It might be today, it might be tomorrow, it might be the weekend. I know. So let's play a game. Tell me who. Let's play a game. Let me ask you guys a question. Who will be the first to sign for Manchester United? Andres Onana or Rasmus Holland? Drop your comments below. That will be a game for us because this is an interactive uh, 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 community we are building where you guys are the star. Tell me who you think will be signed first. Let's see how how good or how uh, fast you can do in terms of uh, uh, if you were playing a lottery, basically. <laughs> yes, but yeah, because there's a lot of news news going on here of United have to, Ten Hag has made it clear that we have to go, we uh, we have to start, um, go on tour with at least three players. He has made that clear that we need, he needs these three key signings here. We have the goalkeeper, we have had already Mount. By the way, Mount, there are a lot of pictures here out of Mount training with the first team, if you, you can see them somewhere here. Um, we have also uh, videos of, uh, yeah, we also have videos of the team, very positive team uh, spirit there. Yeah. Yes, I'm going to do a video tomorrow or maybe in the weekend about the players who are reportedly have to leave Manchester United, the potential value for these players. And uh, I would love also you guys to get involved. But for now, please, please, please make sure you click the like on the video. If you watch this video, subscribe to the channel. We have Manchester United channel in Asia. We have them in Europe, in the UK. Where we have, we do we need someone to represent Manchester United in our African community? This is not a racist channel, but I mean, so you guys, because there are a lot of you guys here in my Facebook groups, most of you uh, Africans also asking questions, what's the situation about missing Greenwood? And now you, there is a video out, there is a, a somehow confirmation that he will be playing next year in Italy, uh, reportedly uh, Atlanta. So um, now it's your turn. We want to hear what you think about that. Is good. Is it good? Messi Greenwood has chose Atlanta over Juventus, a club that has less pressure. So that gives him the advantage of expressing himself. Drop your comments below, and I'm waiting to hear from you. With that all said, guys, talk to you soon, guys. Ciao, ciao.